What is up, beautiful people? Hey, it's Four Leaf Cards here. Thanks for clicking. I'm doing a video, if you haven't guessed it already, for Mr. Lou Rock TV. Got a nice little contest going on, uh, putting together a, a, um, a lineup using only relic cards. And uh, I've got a few, but I'm telling you, when he says it exposes holes in your collection, uh, it definitely does. So uh, I've got some... some uh, some things that I want to put on my hit list for the national uh, in the relic category. So uh, we're going to jump right in. Uh, so nine man uh, batting lineup. I'm going with the uh, the DH, but I'm also going to throw throw in some pitchers here. We've got a nice little pitcher battery uh, that we're going to take a look at. Uh, starting off, I shouldn't show you the other ones here, but uh, starting off with Mr. Phil Necro. That's a sweet, uh, old school, authentic game worn. Uh, with a nice little stripe on there. Uh, I got a picture of the 69 card. I thought that one was pretty cool, so I picked that one up. Um, dominant pitcher here, Mike Mussina. Super nice dude, too. A little bit of a napkin, but hey, whatever. It is what it is. Napkins count. Uh, this is a dark-looking card here. Let's see if you can see it. But it's Tom Seaver. It's another dominant pitcher. We're getting a nice... Uh, Set of, ah, this one is cool. Nice set of uh, starting pitchers here. Nolan Ryan, game used bat. I am I am fanatical about that. I love collecting cards of pitchers hitting and uh, game used bats of pitchers. That's, uh, to me, that's just pretty cool. And, uh, you know, one of the, Best pitchers in the game, maybe. Nolan Ryan. We get them. We got Pedro. I mean, how'd you like to go in a three-game series with this team, right? Uh, I don't think I have a Pedro in a Red Sox uni with a relic. I picked this one up cheap. You know, I figured I needed a pay, at least a Pedro relic, but uh, I need to get Pedro in a Red Sox uni. Hmm. Interesting. Of course, you need a closer, and uh, how can we not put in uh, Eckersley? Also, uh, got some red time with the Red Sox, so I do have a little Eckersley PC, if you will. So there you go. There's the pitching batter battery. We've got some starters. We've got some closers, or a closer, I guess. We could also be a starter very well if we needed them to. Um, but there you go. Let's jump right in. Batting first, my man. Super high average, Wade Boggs. Most of these are just kind of plain napkin-y things, but it is what it is. So there you go, Wade Boggs. I figured, you know, let's get him on, get him on base and then just keep keep the power coming behind him. This is from my buddy Dustin, uh, Dustin and Blake. I haven't even taken it out of the thing, but I try to keep the uh, notes. I got to do a better job as I'm putting these away, uh, making sure I remember who they're from. It's going to be uh, um, confusing on where everything's from. But anyway, a uh, absolutely beautiful number to 199, Carl Yastrzemski. Um, Old school kind of linen-y cloth from tier one. Love that card. He has this out in the outfield. Uh, following right behind another outfielder. So Boggs obviously playing third base. But uh, I should have taken these out of these plastic things. But uh, this is from my Home Run Derby collection, uh, which I also am um, working on. Uh, but Griffey, got to have him. Super power in there. And this could possibly be one of my favorite relics ever. This is from uh, Sticks and Seams. Oh, sent this over. This bad boy, uh, not not only coming from uh, Allen and Ginner, which is one of my favorite, but look at this thing. Watch watch this thing. Whoa, man! Number to twenty five. That is just impressive. I've got a bunch of other Ortiz uh, relics, but um, this is a, quite possibly my best relic card. Um, he sent me a nice, uh, Jim Rice and, uh, Evans, uh, Dwight Evans one too, but that doesn't qualify because it's got two people on it, but man, this thing is just chunky and, uh, absolutely awesome. Uh, one of my favorites. So I'll put that back in that nice case. Don't want to get that ruined up there. And so now I get some power coming in here. We get some more, uh, just fire. This is from uh, JT Triple Crown uh, as he was kind of getting trimming down his Cabrera set. Uh, this nice um, 
Relic Auto Cabrera. Just a beautiful card. Number 49. So there you go there. Now we're coming to the back end of the, uh, I had him at first base, by the way. Ortiz is our DH. Needed a shortstop. Got to put the Iron Man in there. There's a legendary lumber, Cal Ripken. I could use some more shortstops. I got some Nomar stuff, but I went with Ripken. Uh, another outfielder here in Frank Robinson. Nice piece of bat there. There you go. And we got, you know, second base. I got I to gotta work on that second base position, but I did have a Nelly Fox. And uh, I got Billy Williams, I think, too. But I went with, I went with uh, Nelly Fox. Nelly Fox. And finishing up the lineup, playing catcher. A very significant card for this contest. This is from a trade with my man Lou Rock. A beautiful, shiny pack pulled by Lou Rock. Carlton Fisk Auto Relic. Beautiful card. Absolutely stunning. Numbered out of 50 if you can see it. From Lou Rock TV, there you go. Pretty darn cool. So there it is, buddy. Uh, appreciate the contest, all of you that are watching. Thanks for watching. Appreciate your time. And as always, if you guys are open anything, best of luck to you. Don't forget to collect to connect. It's the people in the hobby that are the best part. And have an awesome day.